Hi folks, CJ Oaks here with OaksWriting.com. I want to uh, share a little bit about uh, the difference between SEO and SEM. One of the things we our clients often ask us here at OaksWriting.com is if we can uh, make their uh, website search engine optimized. You know, um, really that's kind of a defunct term. Um, and I'm going to share why here in a moment. You know, back in... Uh, before Google made some changes to their algorithm in 2009 through 2012, um, a lot of companies had built uh, in, entire industries based, entire industry was built up around the idea of search engine optimization uh, with the entire goal of reaching what was called Google PageRank. Well, Google PageRank is gone. It's been eliminated. Now, it may come back in the future. We don't know. But Google built their search engine on the idea of PageRank because it would look at an entire website and say, well, how well does this website conform to certain elements that we believe are important for a good website? And in the early years of search engines, that was important because I don't know if, how many people remember, but at one time before Google came along and dominated everything, you could type in, in your search engine, um, as an example, girls and horses. You know, maybe you had a 13-year-old girl who liked riding horses and she wants to learn a little bit more about doing that. What you would end up getting instead would be um, quite often very terrible content, um, maybe involving bestiality and underage girls. It was, it was terrible. It was, it, it was not the kind of results that you would want to get. Um, so one of the things Google did was help us to get the kind of results that we wanted to get while getting rid of the trash that we don't want to get. Now if you want sites like that, you're going to have to specifically include terms like, you know, um, porn and what and whatever. Now you're going to get the kind of information that is going to be appropriate to all audiences unless you specifically request otherwise. And that was a major change with Google. Well, then in 2000 uh, by in the decade that followed, a lot of websites, a lot of uh, optimization companies, there were there, there came along Black Hat and White Hat, and a lot of people found ways of manipulating the search engines to drive uh, websites up higher in the rankings. That came to be known as SEO, and there were uh, some site, some some companies that did a very good job and a very honorable uh, way of doing this, and there were some that used less than honorable means, like uh, masking text in behind. Like uh, for instance, you could fill a page with information. Uh, that was all in white. The, the text was in white and then the page itself was white so readers wouldn't actually see that text but the search engines would and they would uh, adjust their results accordingly so you would still get skewed results. You would get information that wasn't what you were looking for. Google picked up on this and changed the rules and that threw a number of SEO companies into a tailspin. They didn't know what to do. So at Oaks Writing I was I was just getting involved with the internet at that time, so I learned what to do, what not to do, and one of the things I did was I just simply relied on what Google says uh, uh, translates into a good web page. Uh, the difference between SEO and SEM, SEO looked at an entire site and drove a site up in the page rank ratings. Well, that's gone. Now we have what's called search engine marketing, or SEM, and what SEM does is it creates pages that uh, the search engines will like. In other words, SEM markets to the search engines. And that's a very different concept because a, web, a website can have one or two pages that do very well with the search engines and then the rest don't do anything at all. And that's a little bit more, that's more fair because in the past, it, the, the, if you had one or two pages that did very well, Google might rank the entire site well, and the rest of the page, the rest of the site is garbage. Today, in order to rank well, you you need to focus on the individual pages, and that's what we do here at OaksWriting.com. We focus on the individual pages. Each page taken as itself, as a content tool for your readers to to help them um, get the information they're seeking. That's just part of search engine marketing. At OaksWriting.com, we're going we're gonna to explore this uh, in, in greater detail and much more depth. We're going to include videos in the future um, that will help our, our readers understand better how to use SEM to drive 
uh, traffic to their websites. But um, suffice to say, that's the, the basic difference between SEO and SEM. Now, of course, if you like this video, please like it, share it. And most importantly, subscribe because we are going to be giving more, getting in, into more detail about these things in the future. And of course, you can always visit OaksWriting.com. There's lots of information on there. It's, it's specifically geared towards law firm and real estate uh, agency websites, but really we help any business that needs help. Uh, don't forget OaksWriting.com. Subscribe now.